These six first responders are on a mission, risking their own health to help others in the epicenter of the country's fight against coronavirus. Kudos to all of our staff that are willing to put their lives on the line to help others. Chris Stawas of American Medical Response says on Tuesday, New Hampshire sent two AMR crews to New York City. They're responding to 911 calls, assisting FEMA and NYC firefighters. Today, it was Brooklyn, but they're in all the boroughs and they are busy. His response was it's it's what we normally see times 20. Overall, AMR sent 250 ambulances from across America to New York. One is from Manchester, another from Nashua. The desire to help strong among paramedics. The amazing part was when we put out the call for volunteers for our staff of who wanted to go. Uh, we literally had uh, a list two pages long of people that were, were willing to go down there and assist uh, other people. Locally, AMR is seeing a drastic dip in 911 calls of 30 percent in the state's two largest cities. We think that's directly related to the lack of human activity that's uh, going on on the streets, less motor vehicle crashes, uh, you know, less uh, interactions with people. A sign that Stawas says Granite Staters are following the stay-at-home order. The next two weeks are going to be a uh, telltale of what's going to happen and how we're going to get through this. And the most important thing that people can do is stay home. As for those six AMR paramedics, they will be in New York City for at least two weeks, but that timetable could be longer as that city deals with a surge in COVID cases. Reporting live in Manchester, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.